Look at this lion, sitting in the middle of the street like an idiot, trying to absorb his surroundings, finding a meaningful meaning. Wait, does that make any sense? It's all right, let's continue. Finding a meaningful meaning in his inner peace and meditating by taking photographs of the environment around him. This boy looks optimistic and adventurous. There is something about him that just makes me want to go there and talk to him. I just want to ask him, didn't you find your behens yet? Is this a dream? Is this real? Where is she? Good morning everyone, how are you feeling? I just woke up guys and uh, I just woke up, not in any other place in this world, I woke up in a very very special, I'm stuck, in the middle of the Caribbean place. Uh, St. Kitts and Navis this week, I'm leaving actually tomorrow, I'm staying here only for a few days unfortunately, but uh, it's, it's a nice place, it's a very nice place, I just had a monkey on the roof. You know, I could feel it, made noises, and uh, it's really funny. I mean, there are all sort of an animals here. You have monkeys, you have uh, frogs. Last night I uh, had frogs. Uh, they make a really weird sound, those frogs. I couldn't, I couldn't really sleep in the beginning, but then I, I kind of got used to the sound. I have this sound of, you know, um, the playground thing, whatever. <laughs> So yeah, Sun Kids and Navies this week, really happy uh, to be here, spending my vacation before heading to Anagada. Uh, this island is actually pretty humid. Uh, when I arrived, when I first arrived here, I felt, I felt you know, the difference in the air, uh, the moisture, the humidity, all of it. It's, it's so much different than Miami. There's a beautiful mountain, if I'm not wrong. It has the map over there. So this, so this is Nevis. We, I'm in Nevis, I'm not in Sun Kitts. I took a ferry to come here to Nevis. My flight originally was to St. Kitts. I took a ferry which was... So I took a ferry from up here, St. Kitts, to get to Nevis. Took me around, you know, 30 minutes, not too long. And now I'm here in this beautiful apartment, villa you can call it. Room service all day long. Flying my drone. I uh, have a small swimming pool over there. Private swimming pool. Uh, the TV doesn't seem to work for some reason. Nick, you gotta fix that next time. That is unacceptable. <laughs> I'm joking. Who needs TV on vacation? Yeah, I got a, the Mavic 2 Zoom right here. It's really nice. On my own. We have uh, family friends that gave me this villa. They actually live here. They come here a few times a year. So I'm really grateful for that. Thank you, Nick. Thank you, Indira. It's a lot of fun. Spending spending time with the monkeys and the frogs. They kept me they kept me awake uh, last night. I mean, in the beginning I, I was thinking to myself how I'm gonna fall asleep with all these noises and sounds outside. But then, you know, you get to the rhythm, you get to the pace, you adjust and you sleep like a baby. Vacation, baby, vacation! <laughs> yeah, let's go!
My adventure began by starting the day driving a golf cart. A quote that inspires me in life and a quote that I live after is fill your life with adventures, not things. Have stories to tell, not stuff to show. Very important in my life. So going for breakfast, I have no clue where the reception is. I guess I'm gonna have to discover and find out on my own. It's pretty interesting, you know? I don't have a driving license, but I'm a good golf club. No. Take two. I don't have a driving license, but what I know is that I'm a golf. Take three. I don't have a driving license yet, but what I know for sure Six and a half hours later. I don't have a driving license yet, but what I know is that I'm a good golf cart driver. <laughs> Where are we going now? Shit, I broke it. I think I just broke the golf cart. What the hell is that? Jesus Christ. Help! Jesus. Oh my. What the hell was that? I think I just broke the golf cart. Oh my God. I think I just broke what the hell is this This guy doesn't know. Guys, I take my words back for what I just said. I'm a horrible driver. I just crashed the golf cart. My God, why? Why? Jesus. I don't think it's working anymore. No, I broke it. I definitely broke it. I think I just broke this uh, wheel over here. Yeah, it makes a very weird sound. Oh my. It's out of position. Oh, uh, shit. This is it's broken. The arm, the arm. Yeah, I officially had my first car crash today. In Sakits and Avis, who would have thought? I'm not proud of myself, I can tell you. So people, these are the consequences when you want to vlog while driving. So if there's a lesson to take out of this, don't vlog while driving. Big, huge mistake. I paid for it. It's like, same as, same as texting. Maybe even worse. Yeah. Do I get in trouble? I don't know. Let's see. I'm playing tennis at the Four Seasons and I saw this guy with a camera with long hair <laughs> and he's shooting something. I, that's got to be Tsitsipas because what other tennis player is always shooting things. That's me. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> I love this island. It's a beautiful place. Have you ever been here before? No, that's my first time. Yeah. Yeah, Nevis. It's not that crowded. It's not that like a yeah. lot of tourists and stuff like that. You know, it's a very low key place. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Okay. And, so uh, I'm, I'm actually very glad it has tennis courts. You know, it's, it's did you a bring very, your family? very active place. You know, you have basketball, you have tennis. Because I've been to some islands that don't have anything there. Oh yeah, it's no, Nevis is really, are you training here? No, I'm You're just uh, here for fun. Vacation, yeah, vacation. Did yeah. you bring your family or something? You're just kind of relaxing? Uh, just alone, alone. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, there's a lot of great stuff to shoot and if you drive around like some of the beaches. And it's very unique. There's, yeah. there's a ton of places that don't have anything but you and your camera. Perfect, that's, that yeah, sounds amazing. Do you have one amazing. of those maps of Nevis? Uh, no, but desk. I have a I have a canvas in my room which uh -huh. has the, the 
Okay. It has a picture like of the of the map. So the... if you go down to the, there's two great places you should definitely go. One is Nisbet. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Nisbet Plantation. Right. They have the Caribbean and the Atlantic meeting. If you look out, you're going to see the two oceans meeting. It oh, is together. absolutely stunning beyond belief. Is, is it far you have to video it. How far is it from here? Ask them. Can you remember that or should I write it down for you? How, 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 plantation. Nisbet. Nisbet Plantation. You go there. Nisbet you're not a guest. You can, don't have to have lunch if you want. Just sure, go yeah. with your camera. You'll see if you walk to the right when you drive in, it's puns like a mile nobody there and the two oceans meet it's the most beautiful There's spot practically on the island and I there's will. another for sure, place yeah, for sure. which is the southern uh southern eastern coast what's that one called anyway this is super wild beach mm -hmm. tons of wild animals cows everything goats every you will just love it down there. all right I'll ask Hanley I'll ask Road yeah. okay sure go down Hanley Road I hope you nice remember these you. two places thank you thank have you. a great time Bye. have fun thank you I just met two wonderful people here in that island that were willing to talk and have a discussion with me. It's great. I'm going to Nisbet Plantation, is that right? Please don't forget it. Nisbet Plantation. <sighs> From what the lady said, it looks very interesting and uh, I think for my shooting, it's going to be spectacular. So let's try it. Let's. I'm thinking maybe I should go in the afternoon and film some stuff there. What do you guys think? I don't know, I feel like vlogging has uh, made my life uh, a bit more fulfilling, put a smile on my face and uh, basically enjoy more of what I'm doing, my life and the adventures that I'm uh, at, all the traveling, all the exploring on my own sometimes and uh, being away from uh, social media and uh, away from uh, people and disconnecting from the world. I feel it's a great tool that you can use and uh, be creative, use it in your advantage, be Feel, feel like you're doing something, you know, feel you're, you're creating something uh, out of scratch and um, vlogging is, is the way to go.